seem like my life been really changing on me I know some niggas out here hating on me Ay, I see the bitches how they changing on me I know some niggas out here snaking on me Ay, see like my New artist alert, new artist alert, new artist alert Twigga squad alert, Twigga squad alert 10k alert, 10k alert, what's the goddamn deal paper? So look, I read in my comments that I need to do Nick Natali Is it Natali? I think that's how you said Natali, 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 it doesn't matter, we roll it Anyways, I need y'all to start letting me know new artists to do Yes, I know you did this before when I first started and I got to a lot of them, but a lot of them I didn't get to I want to get back to that again, I want to start having artists, new artists Not artists I've already done, but new artists and everything else So I can get other people on my platform and I can get other subscribers too, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm trying to build this platform up to a bigger platform than what it is now And so I need everybody's participation and I have my y'all have my participation. I need y'all's participation too. So I need you to like, comment, subscribe, like I said. But Nick Natali. I don't know anything about his music. Never heard of this dude. Don't I think I seen a picture. He's either white or black, white and black, or he's mixed or something. Something like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what the fuck going on. But we finna find out. It's called I'm sorry. I'm sorry that uh Actually I don't feel like I need to be sorry for nothing, because I'm dropping the videos again. I'm back on my shit. So let's get into it. Let's get into it. Come on, Nick, what you got for me, buddy? I'm happy Tupac died. Way before the motherfucker swipe up. Hold on, wait a minute. God damn. Hold up, before I even go further, I hope that this nigga didn't mean that. Because I fucks with Tupac, as you can see. Who was that right there? That's Pac. He died on my fucking birthday. That's like my nigga, you know what I'm saying? It's like my uncle, my big brother or something, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. I hope, and nigga look like Pac. But I hope that I just read this wrong and I just judged it from just the first verse. So let me just start it over and let's try this again. <sighs> Lord save me. I'm happy Tupac died way before the motherfucking swipe up. Could you imagine? Could you imagine niggas out here trying to get their likes up? Okay. Or really trying to get the hype up? Okay. Or saying you should follow me or like us? Okay. Everybody that was killed. Was everybody that was righteous? Whoa. Uh, you really think Jimi Hendrix gave a motherfucker about his friend list? Uh, if we had Facebook back then. Okay, I'm back on it. Okay, Nick, I was judging you from the beginning. That's my fault. I was being a fucking human being. I'm not trying to be a human being. I was judging you from the beginning. My fault. I take it back, cuz, okay, we won. We cool. I'm sorry, Nick. Don't judge me, Nick. I'm judged you, but don't judge me. What would they say about Lennon? What would they say about the legends? Uh, who didn't have an online presence. Uh, what about the ones we remember? For real? Still playing, never had to hit enter. Uh, still tripping on the words that they sent us. It's still fuck the police, no surrenders. Uh, so tell me where we going, where we headed. Cause this shit looking like a fucking dead end. It does. And I'ma keep it real till I'm dead, man. Hey man, this dude's really, he's speaking his facts, man. He really speaks his facts, bro. Them legends didn't give a fuck. They wouldn't have cared about no likes and shit and trying to get their shit up, man. Like, it's fucking crazy, bro. All the shit that we got going on with the social media shit and the niggas, y'all care about likes and women, y'all care about likes. and It's all about likes and how many followers you have. Like, nobody give a fuck about that shit. And I'm truly hoping everyone's offended. Whoa. If I made you mad, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Uh, for real. If I made you sad, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Take the good to bad, you know I'm sorry, yeah. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Hey, this nigga funny. <laughs> I love funny videos like this. <laughs> I love funny videos like this. He's speaking his truth though, regardless of what he's doing and what he's yeah he is in his video and if shit he got on, he's speaking his fucking truth. Yeah. Anyone who paid the fucking way huh. is probably turning in their fucking grave. For real. No, they ain't looking at your page. I'm nope. trying to double tap on your face. For real. Who's the clip back in my day? Uh. Dang. Niggas used to feel pain. Uh. Now everybody trying to ride a wave instead of staying in the fucking lane. For real. Could you imagine Jim Morrison on Twitter? <laughs> Nigga, that would be the day. Uh. What about MLK? Jim Morrison. Would he be harassed for what he say? Ah, uh, for real. Well, then nigga would be harassed for what he say because freedom of speech now. You know what I'm saying? Back then. They threw everybody in fucking jail. All the fucking leaders who spoke their words and everything threw everybody in jail. They were top of the FBI. All black people who was trying to help black people was top of the F fucking BI. I'm okay, fucking goddamn um, Malcolm X, everybody was top of the FBI. Fucking Huey and everybody from the Black Panthers, top of the FBI. Why? Even the lady, I can't remember the lady's name right now, but she was part of it too. Like everybody's top of the FBI. Because what? Because nobody fucking cares about black people, man. Goddamn. Nobody cares about how we feel and what the fuck we've been through and the shit we still going through. But now everybody's in one now. This 5G coronavirus shit is making everybody one. So now everybody gets to feel the same shit that we feel, nigga. 
Would they try to stop him? Uh. Block him saying that he's trying to start a war with the races. For real. Come on, y'all, we gotta face this. How we paying homage to the greatest? For real. And how we really call these the A-list? And why we only represent the fake shit? For I'm real. just shooting, I don't know what the aim is. I'm just talking, I don't know who gon' play this. <laughs> feels like we obsessed with the famous. For real. And it really feels like times are changing. Internet got the whole world crazy. Internet got the whole world fucked up, nigga. I got the whole world thinking that shit. This reality fake shit is real, nigga, though, nigga. This fake ass reality, y'all trying to live on social media now. Y'all niggas need to stop that shit, cause when they stop the motherfucking internet, like I keep saying, then what you niggas gonna do? Oh no, I can't do nothing. I don't have no banks. I have no subscribers. I have no followers. No one loves me no more. Fuck all that, man. Don't do that shit, man. Wake the fuck up, people. This nigga speaking his facts. Pre I'ma subscribe to this nigga when I'm done. Internet, look at Kanye's baby uh, In a bed, please someone save me Internet, did a please don't blame me uh, If I made you mad, I'm sorry I'm sorry, yeah uh, If I made you sad, I'm sorry I'm sorry, yeah uh, If I take the good to bad, you know I'm sorry, no, I'm sorry yeah. yeah I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, yeah If I made you mad, I'm sorry if I made you mad, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, yeah. I'm sorry, yeah. If I made you sad, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, yeah. <laughs> if I take the good to bad, you know I'm sorry, yeah. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, yeah. Huh, okay, so look, here's the deal. Why judge this video for anything else than what it should be judged for. Let's judge it for the motherfucking facts that the nigga was speaking. He's speaking straight facts in this. I don't even know who Nick Detoli is. I don't want to speak nothing bad about him because she was speaking fucking facts. My mind, what he had on and everything else, that nigga was being funny. That shit was funny as shit. It went with the video. But he's speaking fucking facts. Social media is now the curse of the world. Social media is the curse of everybody. Social media is the curse of the entire generation of the world right now because of what it does. Not everybody, but most people. You know what I'm saying? The generation of now, shall I say yes. So it sucks. It sucks that everybody just thinks that what you see on live and what you see on Facebook and TV and everything else is real, reality. They only put on TV what they want us to see. They only put on social media what they want us to see. News, news, news is all about bad shit, bad shit, bad shit. There's nothing good no more. There's really nothing good on TV anymore. It shit sucks. The world it fucking went from being good to motherfucking shit. It's bullshit. Did you hear that pop? My fucking shoulder pop. But anyways, it's just bullshit. Everything that we're going through right now is just bullshit. Bullshit, bad shit. The people suck. Fucking everybody sucks, basically. If y'all think I suck, then I fucking suck. Well, oh, well, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, yeah. If you think John sucks, our Twitter sucks, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna fuck. And anyways, sorry to be cussing and being so just, ah, all right. And just on the camera, just going spazzing and shit. But you know, it's just the way the shit is. But man, Nick, I fuck with you, bro. Kudos to you. Good job for doing what you're doing. Because the message you giving out was fucking A1. I'm not going to talk shit about anything else because I have no reason to talk shit. Most niggas going to say, oh, look at the nigga with this and this and that. That's not me. I fuck with you and I fuck with the message behind this shit. So, therefore, I'll probably be end up checking out some more of your music. Drop another hit, Nick. Shout out.